Day 7 of the FIS Freestyle Free Ski and Snowboard World Championships in Bakuriani, Georgia, and it was the mogul skiers who are ready to put on a show. With weather problems elsewhere in Bakuriani for slopestyle and for ski cross, it was all over to the mogul skiers. Jakara Anthony, one of the big pre-event favorites, having a problem in final one, and she was out, leaving the door wide open for the rest of the field. Into final two, and the Austrian, Avital Carroll, took home the bronze medal. A great run in final two, full of flair and style, and blended with great turns and speed, bringing Austria just their third medal in moguls at the World Championships in the history of the sport. Jalen Kauf is a big occasion skier, and she delivered in final two. The American already has an Olympic silver medal, in her career, and she went on to match that performance here at the World Championships. Always a quick skier, Kauf will surely have one eye on the dual moguls world title to take place tomorrow. It was all down to Perrine Lafont from France, the defending champion looking for her fourth world title. And a near flawless run from the French woman who is in unbelievable form this season bringing her the gold medal. Quick, fluid turns, holding the line, exceptional airs, and Perrine Lafont does it yet again at the World Championships. So Lafont, the gold medalist again, ahead of Jalen Kauf and Avital Carroll. Wonderful performance from Perrine Lafont, and she will surely be one of the favorites for tomorrow's dual moguls. Yeah, it's crazy. It was such a hard day because, you know, you can feel the pressure. And uh, yeah, it was long, but I made it through. I know the pressure. I know how it feels. I know how, how it's hard, but you just have to say OK to that and just ski. That's all. <laughs> well, great scenes on the podium as Perrine Lafont becomes a world champion for the fourth time in her career, she joins Jennifer Heil and Carrie Tra atop the all-time leaderboard with four world titles. The crowd were expectant here in Bakuriani in Georgia as men's final two got underway. Walter Balberg was on his way to a bronze medal and the Olympic gold medalist from Beijing 2022 put down a great run to move into second place behind Matt Graham. Great skiing as always from Walter Valberg, but it was Graham who led. And now we'll take a look at Matt Graham's run. The 2018 Olympic silver medalist battled back from injury after missing most of last season and is in fine form. Matt Graham with a quick run, hardly making a single mistake in the turns. An exceptionally high scoring men's final was all going to come down to one man. In the start gate, last to go, Mikel Kingsbury from Canada, the King. And he put down one of the best runs of his career on his way to the gold medal at the World Championship title. One of the highest scoring men's moguls world championships in history. And Kingsbury continues his dominance of the sport. An 89-82 for Kingsbury to take the win, and you can see just how much this one meant to him. Ahead of Matt Graham, who takes the silver, and Walter Valberg from Sweden, who takes home the bronze medal. Pavel Kolmakov in fourth for Kazakhstan. I came here with no pressure, because I told myself, like, you know, I've won six times the World Championship, so why put pressure again and try to, you know, scan my best and and try to leave nothing on the table. The guys were pushing. It was one of the strongest super finals I skied in. And yeah, I just believe in me. And uh, yeah, that was, uh, that was super awesome. A thrilling day of moguls comes to a close in Bakuriani as Kingsbury is on the top step of the World Championship podium for the seventh time in his career. No other man in FIS freestyle history has ever won more than three. Tomorrow, the dual moguls is in action on the same hill. We've also got the rescheduled ski cross and the ski cross team event. So Sunday is going to be a very, very busy day here in Georgia. Make sure you follow the hashtag.
Curiani 2023. For more, 